What do you do if you've had a successful parathyroid surgery and a year later after surgery, you still have high vitamin D levels? I'm Dr. Bob Axmario from Center for Advanced Parathyroid Surgery. Um, vitamin D, the one that we're accustomed to testing, is called 25-hydroxy vitamin D, which is inactive. It doesn't really do anything. In the kidney, parathyroid hormone comes in and activates an enzyme that turns inactive vitamin D to active calcitriol, all right? Um, and the units of this are a thousand times less than that, all right? So if you have 10 calcitriols, it's equivalent to 10,000 of these precursors, all right? So now, if your vitamin Ds are persistently high after surgery, you for sure had hypoparathyroidism and you had a surgery that was successful. If your vitamin Ds are still high, which means this is what's being tested and it's high, you have to look at two things. First, are you having symptoms of vitamin D toxicity? And there's a lot of symptoms here. Nausea, vomiting, constipation, abdominal pain, pancreatitis, uh, weakness, fatigue, decreased appetite, dehydration, increased thirst, frequent urination, confusion, agitation, irritability, muscle weakness, bone pain, high blood pressure, which look very much like symptoms of hyperparathyroidism, right? So if you had successful surgery and a year later vitamin Ds are high and you're still having symptoms, then you have to really further investigate to see if your hyperparathyroidism has recurred or is it vitamin D related because the symptoms are so similar. And the way to do that is to not only check your calcium, your PTH hormone, your 25 hydroxy vitamin D, but also the 125 dihydroxy vitamin D. Because if this number is normal or low normal, then you're okay, right? If this number is also high, then you really need to take action to make sure you don't overdo it on vitamin D supplementation or figure out what else could be causing this to be developing. If you're interested in clear parathyroid information, visit us at parathyroid.net. Be well.